Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to form the partial differential equation by eliminating the arbitrary function f. So the number of arbitrary function present in the given expression is 1 and that is f. So we are going to use only the partial derivative with respect to x that is named as p and the partial derivative with respect to y which is named as q. So only first order derivative we are going to use here. Let us take this as first expression. We are going to differentiate this one partially with respect to x. So this is dou z by dou x and it is 2x and 2 is constant f derivative is f dash. The inner function should be written as it is. Then as for the chain rule, we have to find this derivative and write it as the next term. 1 by y, y is constant because we do partial derivative with respect to x. So this is 0 and this is 1 by x. Now rearranging this, we have to take this to the other side. So this is p minus 2x equal to 2f dash of 1 by y plus log x into 1 by x. Let us take this as the second expression. In the same way, we are going to take the first expression again and we are going to differentiate partially with respect to y. So, z which is dou z by dou y and first term x square is constant because now we do partial derivative with respect to y. So, other than y is treated as a constant. So, that term will become 0 and 2 is written as it is. f derivative is f dash all the inner functions should be written as it is. Then as for the chain rule, we have to find the derivative of this and we have to write it. Now 1 by y is minus 1 by y square and since x is constant, log x is also constant. So which is 0 by differentiating. Now rearranging this is q equal to 2f dash of 1 by y plus log x into minus 1 by y square. This is our third expression. Now we are going to divide the second expression by third expression. So we get p minus 2x by q and while dividing 2 into f dash term gets cancelled in both numerator and denominator. So we are writing only the remaining term that is 1 by x by minus 1 by y square. Since it is a fraction we can take a reciprocal and multiply so p minus 2x by q equal to 1 by x into y square by minus 1. So on rearranging we get p minus 2x by q equal to minus y square by x. When we cross multiply we take product of these two. So it will be px minus 2x square equal to minus q y square. Now our final answer should be in the form of capital P small p plus capital Q small q equal to r. So we want p term that is x into p. So first term is written as it is. Then let us take this term to the other side. So plus y square q and we have to take this term to the right hand side. So we get 2x square. So this is our required partial differential equation after eliminating the arbitrary function.